Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to be playing some Genshin Impact. Now this is the new gacha game that everyone's talking about now. Um, I've had it downloaded since it came out, since its release, pretty much. But I've never actually bothered to play it until now, and I thought that I would just give my first reactions on it. Probably just probably going to play it for maybe an hour. Um, probably gonna... I think I will enjoy it. It's an open world RPG. I've played a bunch of gachas. I've not seen anything about this game. The only thing I know is that it's an open world RPG and it's a gacha game. Uh, so I don't know what to expect, but uh, let's just get right into it. Alright, let's see what we've got. So, what you're trying to say is that you fell here from another world? Okay. What's happening? But when you wanted to leave and go on to the next world, your path was blocked by some unknown god? Interesting. Interesting. Who's it? Who's Outlanders, this? your journey ends here. Who are you? The sustainer of heavenly principles. The arrogation of mankind ends now. <laughs> This is our main character then, I guess. I'm just gonna put that. Because why not? Right. This guy, this guy's here. Ether! Oh, so okay, I'm not sure, but I'm guessing the main goal is to save him. siblings and just like that the god took away my brother some kind of seal was cast upon me and I lost my power so whilst we used to cross world after world we are now trapped here okay so let me get this straight from this they have the power wait hold on how many years ago was it I don't know but I intend to find out. After I awoke, I was all alone. Right up until I met you two months ago. Yeah, Paimon really owes you for that. Otherwise, Paimon likely would have drowned. So Paimon will do her best to be a great guy. Oh, this guy. is Paimon. That's her name. Does she speak in the third person? We should head off. Let's get going. Yeah, I think she speaks in the third person. At least I think this is Paimon. Okay, there's camera distance using scroll wheel. Cool. Oh, my sensitivity is a bit high. Hold on, let me see if I can adjust it real quick. Sensitivity. Yeah, um, I use a high DPI, so I like low sensitivity. Yeah, this is much better. Okay. Uh, right click or shift. Okay, jump. Okay, cool. Right, so you just follow her? I'm guessing. This is really cool. Um, wait, hold on. This is this is hold on. I think. Okay, never mind. This is. Uh, 
Okay, this is an attack. Okay, so control is a oh, walking. Okay, walking and running. This is switch. F is this. this is cool. Open world. This is kind of what I expected. I like it. Oh, I haven't played many open world games, to be honest with you. So, let's see, what does this do? Okay, so when we get these waypoints, then we can teleport to them, I'm guessing? So what is this? Oh, this is just a starting place, so we can teleport back here if we want. Okay, it's cool. No, where is she? She's all the way over there, what? Can I attack her? I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't know any of their skills or anything. This is just a tutorial, I'm guessing. How to climb the mountains. The path ends here! Guess we'll just have to climb! So it's... Climbing depletes stamina, and depleted stamina takes time to recover! Okay. Okay, let's take the route we planned! <laughs> We're off to... A Statue of the Seven! Which of the seven are you looking for, exactly? I normally don't have the English voices on, I usually have the Japanese ones, because... Priorities... But for this case, I'll just have... Wait, what do we do? Oh, okay. Okay, so we did this. It's very quiet. Very, very, what are those shiny things? I see some shiny things over there. What's this? It's a fruit. Can we collect them? Okay, what's up here? to do. Oh, just follow the path, okay. Okay, this is pretty cool so far, I like it. I, look, I like 3D models. They look really nice. I mean, I guess I can see why this is hype. I like it. That's a statue of the Seven! There are a few of these statues scattered across the land to show the Seven's protection over the world. I like the voice acting, so I don't have to read it Among out the Seven Gods, this god controls the wind. Paimon's not sure whether the god you're looking for is the animal god, but... Paimon will take you to the animal god's place first, and there's the reason why! Yeah, she speaks in third person. Oh, that thing on her, um... The, the uh, thing... That looks like the Phantom CIC logo from Epic 7. As we all know, poetry and language flow like the wind! There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your brother! At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer you is a different story. You never know unless you try. So let's hop to it! Okay, wait, hold on, let me just... <coughs> I just realized something. I'm not using a mouse pad, which is bad. There we go, I got it. Let's just keep going, I guess. I can, I will definitely, I can definitely see myself playing this long. I am a fan of open world games. I haven't played much of them, but the ones that I did play are really good. You can swim right over. So I just what does V do? Press V to navigate. I mean, I'm pressing V. It is not doing anything. Can I swim faster, or I don't know.
I wonder how much the story changes if we choose the, if we chose the brother instead of her. I'm guessing this is where we started. Because I, I saw, I see this. Um, what? Um, now, okay, now, now what do we do? Oh! Did you just feel the elements of the world? Seems all you had to do was just touch the statue and you got the power of animal! As much as they may want it, people in this world can never get a hold of powers as easily as you. Okay, now we choose. Uh, okay, that's weird. that's interesting. So, like, we're special, I guess. It's a bit rude to say that about the power the gods just oh, gave I'm you. Oh, so, I'm sorry. I just thought that I was like, now everyone's gonna want to come for me or something. If we keep heading west from here, we'll eventually reach Mondstadt, the city of freedom. This one. Mondstadt is the city of wind because they worship the god of Animo. So perhaps, because you got power from the god of Animo, you can find some clues there. There are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one of them has heard news of your brother. Let's move then! The elements in this world responded to your prayers, and Paimon thinks that's a lovely sign. Okay, very nice. Very nice. Oh, I just said pressing down two elements is good. What does this do? What, what, what did that do? I have no idea what that did. Okay, so it's on the bottom left. It's on a cooldown. Press and hold E to charge skills for increased power. Windblade. Oh. Okay, that's interesting. I, know, I lost some health. What's the key to the shit? Prepare to be blown away. I'm assuming she's a water element. These are the animal powers you got from the statue of the seven. Oh, nice. I'm assuming. Oh, she's... Paimon's so jealous. Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting powers? Press escape to call Paimon. So, wait. What does? Why do we need to call her? Important message. Left alt. So what does this do? Oh, so we can see the cursor and click on stuff. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Primo gem. Is that like the premium currency or something? That Kalamuni. So we have to get over there. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I'm sure there's a way to check my inventory. Oh yeah, right here, Paimon. Achievements. Does this, like, get me anything? Oh, it does. Uh, inventory, right here, okay. We have a sword. Just a basic sword. Gives 1000 XP. I'm gonna keep this. Weapons. We don't have any other ones, so yeah, that's not gonna work. Oh, 
Okie dokie, let's keep going. What's over here? Can I hit them? I assume I don't want to. Okay, I can hit these guys though. I don't think I'm killing them, to be honest. damage bonus I'm going to equip it I think I'm probably just I think I might play a little bit off camera just so that I can story oh okay dokie okay that's cool so um, I think I might play a little off camera not really to progress to the story, but mostly just to get used to, like, the mechanics and stuff like that. Uh, using the abilities and everything. I think that's what I mainly want to do right now. But, let's just keep it. I really like this. It must have taken a long time to make. Ah! Ow! Get back here. I'm on like a fairy type thing. Huh? Look at that! Oh, that's the thing we saw in the sky. Is it a wyvern dragon? Who is this? Don't be afraid. It's all right now. I'm back. Is he talking to a dragon? I mean, I feel like good thing the dragon didn't notice this is the correct thing to say, but I feel like this is pretty funny. Just what was that? Paimon thought we were gonna get eaten. Hmm. It definitely has something to do with that weirdo who was talking to the dragon. Is talking to dragons normal? <sighs> of course not. No. Oh, what's that? Yeah, that's that? what I was wondering. There's some kind of shiny red thingy on the big rock over there. Let's go take a closer look. I like her voice. Be careful! Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about then, this. Then why are you suggesting it? Crimson crystal. Paimon's never seen a stone like this before, so Paimon can't tell what it is. All Paimon knows is that it's dangerous. Best we put it away for now. Okay, we've got it. Now. Okay, so we're just gonna take. It. Okay, we're adventure rank three. Perfect. That's cool. Okay, kinda lost. Event. No. Oh. oh geez. I'm kinda lost. I don't know what to do. Wait, I have something in here.
Okay, this is our wings that we can use. Cool. Yeah, I'm not gonna pronounce that. Oh, okay, what is this? Wishing item. What is a wishing item? Is that like the summoning system? Oh. That's cool. Claim this ready. Claim this. Yeah, okay, I claimed all of them. Alright, now what? What do we have? No, no. Oh. I see. Level 5. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. That's cool, that's cool. Monstat. What does the wishing item do? That's what I'm wondering. Is that the summoning system? Because I do know there is a summoning system because it is a gacha game, which makes sense. I'm gonna take this. Okay, another cutscene. Hey you! Stop right there! Oh, who's this? It's another girl. Who's this? Why'd she interrupt me? May the Animo God protect you, stranger. I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. Okay. You don't look like citizens of Mondstadt. Explain yourselves. Oh, now we're getting interrogated. Well, we're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. Well, I only have one thing to say. Doesn't sound like a local name to me. And this mascot, what's the deal with it? <laughs> We're friends or emergency food. <laughs> um, I'm gonna say emergency food just because. Hey, that's even worse than being a mascot. <laughs> I love this. So to sum it up, your traveling partner. I'm not right? sure if the dialogue that you choose affects the game very much, besides like the dialogue right after that Paimon says. Well, look. There's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. I'm assuming it was that blue ice one that we saw. I'm assuming it's ice. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Across this bridge? Oh, aren't you out here for some other reason? I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Oh, okay. That's a rather rude way to speak to guess. Well, I mean, I can see why she's suspicious. I mean, we just kind of came out of the forest out of nowhere. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. Okay, I'm sorry. I give you my apologies, uh, strange yet respectable travelers. I see. Well, we haven't even been traveling for very long. That sounded so fake. <laughs> Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? Oh, okay, now they're gonna get an argument. At the ready! Okay, what are we doing now? Okay, now, okay, so she's a... She's a new hero. Let's switch. So, suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? She got <sighs> separated from Told her brother Jacqueline. during a really, really long journey. Paimon is her travel buddy, helping her to find her brother. Oh, looking for your family? Hold on, we have a... We have a sword. Can I switch it? Can, yes. This does uh, more damage. So we can use it. Enhance. Can we enhance? I don't think we have any enhancements though. I'm assuming we don't have things for this. There's a voiceover. Okay. That's pretty cool. Uh, so we switch with one with the okay. number. Okay, let keys. me finish my other stuff first, and then I can help you put up posters around the city. What exactly is it you need to finish doing first? It's simple. You'll understand in we a have bit. To go up here. That's where the map says. Oh, what is this? This is something up here. Oh, 
Quick, get it! Did I hit it? Nope, I didn't. I can't aim. I literally can't aim. I have no aim. These monsters have been getting too close to the city recently. My task this time is to clear out their camp. your moves there so switching so you switch the characters switch the people you're using by using the numbers number keys i'm assuming we have two right now i i wonder i don't know what the max is what the max amount of characters is thanks for the backup how'd it feel well i mean this is kind of the truth but you know now that you mention it how is it the hilly trust ended up here talky. These creatures don't seem like the type to set up camps so close to cities like this. Exactly. It's more normal for them to be much further out in the wilderness. But because the dragon, Storm Terror, has been around a lot more recently, our orchards have been destroyed, and the local market has been affected as well. So, Amber, I feel like her archer, her bow thing, is going to be quite hard to aim because I'm not very good at projectiles. When the storms hit, we usually end up with at yeah, least a few injuries. So the Knights of Favonius have been tied up doing the best they can to defend the area. So these annoying creatures have been getting closer and closer to the city? Exactly. That said, clearing this camp helped make the area a little bit safer. Come with me. A responsible knight must make sure to see you to the city safely. Yes, that makes sense. She doesn't look like a knight, though. Or maybe that's just a style. Right. I'm pretty sure there are seven elements. Okay, so this we're, we have to aim for the head, which probably is common sense. I uh, also need to level her up because she's level one. Mm. Yeah, now they're both level five. All right, that's cool. Wait, there's a chest. I, I didn't open it. What, what am I doing? Hold on. <laughs> cool. This is some more stuff. I see something shiny over here. I just take all that. Because I love hoarding stuff. I just, you know. Right now we go to Mondstadt. Yeah, this bridge over here. And this is a teleport waypoint, so we can I think we can always teleport back here if we use the map. Let me just what's this? Oh no, it's just a character shortcut. Hold on, she had something. Artifacts. This. Attack eight. This is for I wonder if there's um like certain gear. Like certain gear for certain like classes. I'm pretty sure she's an archer. Let's just equip it. Just... Morning. What can I? It's agreed. Getting rest is a. I feel like running. Okay. That's cool. Just the... we can hear the voices, which is nice. I always like that. I always like when you can hear the um, characters' voices. No, we just happen to be passing by. What are you cooking? Wait, hold on. What is this? Oh, right here. Lynn. Can we talk to her? What should I cook next? Wait, this wasn't this the person that was talking to the dragon? Oh, 
Are you travelers from around here as well? No, we just happen to be passing by. What are you cooking? Smells good! I see. Welcome, travelers. I feel like this was the person that was talking to the dragon, Lin. I'm Lin, the survival expert of the Adventurer's Guild. As you can see, I'm experimenting with some new recipes. I mean, she was wearing the same things, right? Or I just have bad memory. Eat before you go. The first rule in the Wilderness Survival Guide. Picnic? Oh, Paimon just loves picnics! My travel partner here is good at cooking as well. That's okay. Let's see what you can do. You won't get a lot of chances like this to learn from a survival expert. There are some mushrooms and meat in the barrel over there. Try making a chicken mushroom skewer for- Chicken mushroom skewer. All right, I got- I got this. I got this. I got this. Don't worry. Okay. Okay, we have to make this. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, wait, hold on. What do we do? Just cook? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Proficiency. Can we do it again? Yeah, we can. Okay. Okay, that's cool. And then we get more proficiency, which probably um, increases like the the stats, like the things that it gives to you. I think that's cool. Is it done? Smells good. Let me try. Mmm. Mmm. I like these voice actors. Mm. Uh, uh oh. Now that's really tasty. You are indeed gifted. I got it. Oh, thanks. I'm gifted. Yay. Paimon told you so. With your culinary skills, you should try more difficult dishes. Oh, I've got some raw ingredients in my bag. Have them in return for this meal. Oh, thank you very much. Can we really have them? Won't you run out of ingredients? That's okay. You should be able to find lots of ingredients when exploring the wilderness. Don't forget to look carefully. There's also a restaurant in Mondstadt known as Good Hunter that sells food and ingredients. Go have a look when you've got the time. All right, that's okay, cool. thank you for the info. <gasps> hey, leave some chicken mushroom skewers for Paimon. Yeah, I think Paimon talks in third person. I actually kind of like that because it's really cute. Let's see, what else can I do here? Okay, I can make the eggs. Yeah, we need the ingredients to do stuff like that. Flour. I guess we can make some of it. Okay, I guess this is like our inventory or something. Okay, let's just keep going. I don't know if I need to stay there to get our flower, but I'm not gonna worry about that. Okay, my stamina's running low. I need to find a way to increase my stamina. Here we are, monster. Is there anything else we need to do? What is this? What is this? Hold on, there's something in the event. Okay, so we need to be adventure rank 20 to get her, I'm pretty sure. So I think what I'm going to do is after this, I'm probably just going to grind this out and get to rank 20. At least that's what I hope. I want to get a rank 20 now. People's choice. Spirit of Spiral event, event. Clear 4 3, Chamber 3 of the Spiral Abyss to win Xiangling Pyro. I probably did not pronounce that correctly. No time limit, adventure rank 20. Okay, so, yeah, adventure rank 20, I, I guess, is the play thing where most things are. Jean will be upset if she catches us lazing around like this. So, yeah. Lawrence, let's talk.
Okay, I probably should be reading this. No one knows its true identity. Alright. Okay, why does he stand like that? He kind of stands in like... Should I talk to him? I think I'll talk to him. I'm Swan, I mostly perform sentry duty. I will also provide the necessary assistance to our business visitors in accordance with the Knights of Favonia's handbook. So he doesn't know? Oh, okay, we were asking about the handbook. Okay, let's just keep going. Mondstadt. Alright, we are here. We are here. Maybe it's the same one, maybe it's not. Let me officially introduce the city of wind, dandelions, and freedom. Travelers under the protection of the Knights of Havonius, welcome to Mondstadt. Finally, no more having to camp outdoors. But the city folk don't look too cheery. Everyone's been put out of place by oh, storm terror recently. But everything will turn out fine as long as Jean's with us. Who's Jean? Jean? Oh, yep. Acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius, Jean, Defender of Mondstadt. All right, cool. With Jean on our side, surely even the vicious Storm Terror will be no match for us. Okay, wait, hold on. Pretty impressive. Before I take you guys to the Knights of Favonius headquarters, I have a present for you, Traveler. All right, let's see what it is. It's a reward for helping me clear out that Hillitrol camp. Oh, nice, a reward. H hey, why doesn't Paimon get a reward? Oh. Uh, because this reward is useless to you, Paimon. But I'll treat you to a traditional Mondstadt delicacy, sticky honey roast. Sticky honey roast! Come with me. We'll head to the city's, uh... High ground. What is that supposed to mean? Just high ground? Alright. Let's just see. Alright. That's cool. Alright, so, um, I think I'm gonna stop here. I will do this maybe off camera because I don't really think it's worth doing. Um, actually, I might, I might not. Maybe I will. But, uh, yeah. I'm just gonna stop here, and, um, first, first thoughts? I'm impressed. I really like this game. It's really cool characters. The voice acting is really great. Um, I'm not, like, a game critic or anything, but I do really like this. So it's, it's just my, just a regular person giving his opinion. I really like it, and, uh, I'm looking forward to playing more in the future. So, anyways... If you enjoyed, uh, if you enjoyed, yeah, maybe leave a like and subscribe. It's free, and you can always change your mind later. But anyways, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.